for today. Oscar nominee Jake Gyllenhaal, whose latest role is that of a U.S. Army sergeant, assigned an Afghan interpreter who accompanies them on dangerous missions. When the team is attacked by the Taliban, the interpreter goes to great lengths to save his sergeant's life, putting his own life at risk. In Guy Ritchie's The Covenant, the sergeant survives and is sent home, but he can't rest knowing that the man who saved his life is still in hiding. So he returns to the war zone to rescue him and repay his debt. In a Zoom chat over the weekend, Jake and Danish actor Dar Salim talked to me about the story of one man literally dragging another across the blistering desert to save his life. Maybe not all Afghan interpreters would be willing to uh, drag a, 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 their, their U.S. soldier across the desert for three weeks, and not all soldiers are, are able to come back and, and mortgage their house um, to bring back their interpreter. But it, the truth of the film is that all interpreters did put their lives at stake every day to help the U.S. military, and the U.S. soldiers all did put their lives at stake every day being there on the ground. And Dar, I hope you didn't really have to drag his butt around uh, too much. Oh, but I did. Oh, he did. Oh, but I yeah. did. Yes, yes. Uh, so it wasn't much acting, to be honest. It's just <laughs> a real struggle. <laughs> Jake, the other day on our show, we showed a video from you on that show where you have to eat hot peppers and you know, drink uh, hot things. Uh, what was that day like for you? Yeah, it was uh, an implosion of sorts. One that, you know, I'm, I'm hopefully no one else has to feel, but uh, it was great fun. <laughs> it was great fun. We will have more with Jake Gyllenhaal later on this morning. Guy Ritchie's The Covenant opens in theaters on Friday.